What is up YouTube? Welcome to the Star Life, and yes, there is no vlog footage really introing this video, but to be honest, I have finals tomorrow, I have my math final, which is the final I am most worried about, and on top of that, it's harder to do the vlog footage when I am crippled, and I have to hop around everywhere. Either way, the content is still coming, but please make sure you smash that freaking like button. <laughs> I don't want any audio infiltration going on. In the last two videos, I didn't beg for likes in the beginning of the video, and it's surprising how many less likes those two videos got. Like, in terms of like likes to dislikes, they did really good. They didn't get a lot of dislikes at all. They got a lot of likes, but they got a lot less than other videos compared to them with the same amount of views. So, I don't know. I feel like a lot of people are like me. I just forget to like videos sometimes. Today, we will be discussing the Supreme Week 17 drop list that was leaked by Drops by J. Of course, shout out to the plug. Now give it up to the plug. I think there are a lot of people that will feel that this week is decent or fire because there are some hype pieces dropping. In my personal opinion, I'm not a big fan of this week, but I do want to clarify something. Just because they have had several consecutive week weeks, in my opinion, that does not mean they're falling off or anything like that. It's just approaching the end of the season. Overall, I think the season has been super strong for Supreme, and they have released so many heaters this season. So, you know, it's okay for them to, you know, just simmer down a little. If you are like myself and are not going for much in this drop, then of course you can check out some of the sales that I've been talking about all week because whenever Essence has a sale, I need to put you guys on game. So yeah, Essence.com or S-S-E-N-S-E.com is having a sale right now. I will leave some links down in the description below. No, this video is not sponsored by them, but it is a great sale. And overall, there are some killer items for those of you individuals who like clothes similar to mine. I don't know why I said mine like that. But if you like brands like Off-White, uh, Noah, there was an $80 Noah hoodie that I don't think I discussed, but I did link in the last video. Uh, there was a $140 Alexander Wang hoodie. There's just tons of good deals. I even linked some items that I know nobody will buy. Like there was a St. Laurent jacket that I linked in the last video. That shit was like $1,300. I know nobody bought that shit, but it was fire. It was beautiful. And I wanted you guys to look at it with me. Anyways, today we have the Supreme 17 drop list. Like I said earlier, I will be doing some polls on Twitter. So make sure you follow me on there and we will see what people are going for, what people are most hyped about. And we will discuss some colorations, some color polls to see what colors people are going for first for each item. So if there's anything that you want from this drop, make sure you follow me on Twitter to see what people are going to cop first. My Twitter will be somewhere on the screen and in the description below. And of course, also go follow me on Instagram where I've already discussed this drop and I will discuss this drop several more times. Then you can ask my opinions or whatever. And on top of that, my Instagram is super lit. Anyways, so the drop list was leaked by Drops by Jay and something that actually I already shot this video, but I had to reshoot it because afterwards Drops by Jay came out with some pretty fire news and uh, supposedly it has been released that the Vans will be dropping tomorrow. Now, personally, I'm not a big fan of these. I think if I was to acquire any of them, low key, I did not know they were dropping these checker ones until looking at it, and those are super freaking dope. Uh, yeah, if I was gonna acquire any of them, they would be the checkered ones. Now that I just saw the checkered ones, I might actually go for the checkered ones. I'm not a big fan of that graphic. I don't know what resale will be, but I do feel like the checkered ones might have some sale value. The estimated retail of those is $88. The mustard and work blue colorway are not for me. I'm not a fan of those colors. Fun fact, I used to have a pair of Vans Authentics in that blue color, and I thought I was going to get some wear out of them, and I never did. But yeah, those checkered ones are pretty fire, actually. The more I look at them, the more I love them. Now, that was released after the actual drop list was already announced, so the actual drop list contains quite a few items and two unseen items. There's an unseen denim Supreme tote bag that will probably be a pass unless it's super loud and the retail is somewhat reasonable to the point where I can uh, justify possibly like reselling it basically because I'm not gonna keep a Supreme denim tote. Uh, also there's a unseen Supreme champion tank top. Now that could be a cop, just depends on the design. If the design is fire, then I'm going to cop it. And it also depends on the price tag as well. If the price is reasonable, then it will be a cop. And depending on how fire it is, it may be a personal cop, it may be a cop for Robotus and Poppy, which is my resale account, as you guys may know, which is where those vans will end up as well. I do like the graphic, but the fact that the slip-ons is still kind of like, eh, to me. I'm not a fan of slip-ons. I like authentics. Now getting into the remainder of the drop list, we have two items that are somewhat hyped. We have the Playboy bowling shirt, and then we also have the Obama button-up. Now, I don't need this Obama button-up. I will probably acquire it to post uh, on my resale account, Robotus and Poppy, but I already have the Obama anorak, and on top of that, I have the Obama sweats. So there's really no point in me acquiring this for myself. It would just be kind of overkill, and the only one that would know. <laughs> like, I'd wear the 
all three like matching set I guess but then it's like you're not even gonna see the shirt because I have the anorak on. Also they have the Playboy bowling shirt and I was looking on the preview online and I zoomed in on the Playboy logo and it kind of almost looks like it's embroidered. So I guess we will see if it's embroidered. That's fire. If it's screen printed, it's still kind of fire. But um, I mean overall I'm not going to acquire it whether it's embroidered or not because I'm not a big fan of that style of tee. If I was to acquire any of them I would cop the pink one because the pink one will be a dope flex piece for your Instagram pictorials. Okay we also have this pocket tee which says I would rather be dead. It actually says I'd rather be dead. Overall I think that uh this tee is all right. If I was to acquire any of the colorways, I would cop the orange and the yellow one. The white and the black ones is eh. We also have the 666 towels, which I know is probably another cop for Kelly because he loves all that 666-ish. Not that I'm against anything 666. I like a lot of dark art, but I just don't feel like that is dark in my opinion. It's just kind of like a Route 66 logo except with 36. Oh. They are dropping two hats. They're dropping the denim supreme all over print, like bucket hat, brick squad, baby freaking safari hat i don't know it's got like tons of little things where you could put some bait in there you could put all sorts of little utility things in there it's just a utility hat that says supreme all over it but it's made of denim i don't it's kind of weird i'm not a big fan of any of the, those denim things uh i didn't cop the jackets or anything really the shorts none of that stuff so i'm not going to acquire this either also they're dropping these camp caps as you guys know i'm not a big fan of camp caps but even this one in particular is just kind of weak to me there have been several camp caps that in my opinion i would have rather acquired instead of these ones so i don't really see the purpose in purchasing those those are metallic camp caps so all those little squares that look like they're shining they are kind of shining they're like little metallic squares that shine so yeah that's the drop list now we also have some rumors to discuss i discussed the rumors and i forgot Got to discuss the box logo rumor so i i just figured i'd reshoot the rumor part and, and plus it's a little bit more personal you know what i'm saying up close and personable damn i am tired anyways um so the rumors that we need to discuss so that way you guys are aware from this point on going forward what i know if you guys know anything extra you can let me know in the comments whatever um but basically long sleeve box logos are not confirmed. I am hoping they are dropping, but I do not know any more or less than you. Do I think they will drop? It just depends on how many weeks there are. If there are two weeks left, then yes, I think they will drop and I hope they will drop. If they do drop, it'll be the last week. But um, yeah, I'm hoping that they do. Earlier, they were going back and forth as to whether it will be short sleeves or long sleeves. Personally, I'm hoping for short sleeves, uh, but long sleeves are quite rare, so. We'll see. Next rumor, Supreme Stone Island. Now, the Supreme Stone Island rumor has been somewhat quiet for several weeks now, so I'm not sure if there's any update on it or if there's any news on it whatsoever. I'm hoping, I'm praying, there's a part of me that believes there will be a Supreme Stone Island collab, but the fact that things have been quiet for quite some time has me thinking that there might not be one this season. I know, I'm sad too. Next up, is the Supreme Nas T. Now this really isn't a rumor. Uh, I believe this has been confirmed as far as I know. It seems like every leaker, every Supreme leaker has uh, verified this, that the Nas T will be dropping fall winter. A lot of people were asking me like, yo, when's the Nas T dropping? What week? Is it dropping next week? Yo, is it gonna drop this week? And I'm like, bro, it's not dropping for a while. So just, just, just be patient, wait. It's not dropping until fall. Winter is what I have read everywhere. I think those are the main rumors that I wanted to address. I also actually think that the next couple weeks will be pretty good. Like the next week or two for Supreme will be fire because we got the summer tees coming soon. We have the bleached lace hoodie and shorts to drop. I mean, there's some whack shit dropping for sure. Like there's the the wave tank and the, the wave shorts. I think those are dumb, but I still think there's some fire to drop. So I think that after this week, we will see several pretty fire weeks. But that's just me being hopeful. Who knows? Anyways, like I said earlier, go check out the sales below if you are not copying anything this week. There are some fire sales. Sadly, I think I'm going to pass on these sweatpants. There's only one size small left, and I haven't decided if I should spend $400 on sweats. But there's a lot of good sales as well. Like, the sale on these sweats aren't that great. They're only 21% off, but there's a lot of Off-White. There's a lot of Noah, Alexander Wang, all those brands that are like, 
50% or more off. Like there's some really good deals. So go check them out in the description below. Unless of course you need to save your bread for the Supreme drop, then you know, then do that. Either way, thank you guys so much for your support. I really do appreciate everything you guys do for me. Remember to smash that freaking like button, baby. And if I post a video tomorrow, I will hopefully have the Supreme live cop. If I don't post it tomorrow, then I'll post it Sunday and it will have, um, several cops in that one video so yeah either way make sure you watch the next video because it will have you know me copying the supreme online in those little vlogs i'm not going to show my screen yet i might incorporate that in the future but i just don't want to right now because then obviously i have to edit it so that way you guys can't see my card and try to steal all my money it's not like i got that much money anyways though so you wouldn't really be stealing that much anyways thank you guys so much for watching like i said earlier and as always keep living the star life I remember way back when, when should I begin? I was out thugging with my friends and sensitizing sin. I would hit the lick and then I hop away.